So they also call him by his full name. So I'm just constantly being called uh, Corbin Blue. Corbin Blue. And I'm like, this is, it's really, it's really, really strange. You guys have both been involved in Disney projects before. Corbin, you were part of the original High School Musical movies. So how did you each get involved with this season of the show? Jason, if you would like to start off. Yeah, I actually, Disney reached out to me before the very first season of the show to see if I would come on as a sort of an acting coach, mentor for the kids, go out with them to Salt Lake City as they you know, start to put this show together. And so I've actually been around for the first couple of seasons helping out with that. Uh, so when they asked me if I wanted to be the curmudgeon -y, camp director for season three for our summer camp season i was like absolutely let me i cannot wait to play on camera with these kids and then with they're bringing corbin in as well uh old buddy of mine i i just i i need to do this now let's make this happen and same for me it was it was a pretty easy yes uh i had first gotten involved with the series when it did come out uh first season just to help promote it i uh at at, uh, at d23 uh and i had um got a chance to meet all the kids and and see how incredible they were and 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 to meet Tim and 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 was just such a fan of how it was such a fresh take on the series and or on 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 the franchise and yet still upheld the legacy in such a, a, a beautiful way um and being able to come back in this light to play myself and to have the arc that I do have uh in this season um it, it was it was such an easy thing to come back to. Well, that actually, um, you know, that makes me wonder, what was it like to play yourself? Like you're playing a character, but you're playing yourself as well. So how is it, what's that process like? It's it's so much fun. It's also weird. You know, I think the weirdest part is, uh, you know, you always, you always have that, uh, sometimes you get called by your character name on set or sometimes, you know, you're, and, and it's just always Corbin. And, and especially because even in scenes, the kids are like fans of Corbin. So they also call him by his full name. So I'm just constantly being called uh, Corbin Blue. Corbin Blue. And I'm like, this is, it's really, it's really, really strange. Uh, but uh, one of the best parts about it is, is it's, uh, you, not only is it, is it relaxed because you, you do get to just, have your own mannerisms or whatever it is, but also it's it's so fun to be able to just sort of make fun of yourself and 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 come be. It's a little bit of an out of body experience. It was really fun to watch in real life as well because the kids in real life are fans of Corbin. So like there, as we got Corbin the first couple of times on set, they were just as nervous as real young actors as their characters were to have Corbin at the camp. And so these st huge stars, I mean, Sophia Wiley and Josh Bassett and like they, I mean, they're stars in their own rights to watch them sort of melt into little kids when Corbin was around was one of the cutest things I think I've ever seen ever. <laughs> All right, that is so awesome. Um, well, then, Jason, what can you tell us about your character? You are playing the camp counselor. Yeah, I'm the camp director, uh, Mr. Dewey Wood. Uh, he is a very curmudgeon -y guy. Uh, he just likes to kill the joy in any situation he's around. Um, I, I, I've said it before, you've never seen anybody love to hate being someplace as much as, as Dewey does. Um, but I think he's he's he secretly loves it. And I think he secretly loves providing this place for these young people to discover things about themselves and put on these shows and, and build these memories. Um, he just likes to sort of poke fun at them as they're, as they're doing it. Okay, awesome. Well, that is all I have for you guys today. Thank you so much for your time. Cannot wait to see you in the brand new season. <laughs> Thank you, Rachel. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.